The country Argentina is named after the element silver. Latin word for silver is argentum. Francium is the rarest element on Earth. There are probably no more than a few ounces present on Earth. The only alphabet not used in the periodic table is the letter J. Now these are just a few fun facts about the periodic table. What is the periodic table? The periodic table is an arrangement of the chemical elements in a table format. The table is arranged into 18 groups and 7 periods. The elements are arranged based on their atomic number, electron configurations, and chemical properties. Elements on the left-hand side of the periodic table are generally metals. Elements on the right-hand side are generally non-metals. It is called a periodic table because of its repeating pattern. Each period contains eight elements and the pattern repeats in the next row. Each element has its own abbreviation in the periodic table. Some of the abbreviations are easy to remember. For example, H for hydrogen. Some are a little bit harder, like Fe for iron or Au for gold. The abbreviation for gold, Au, comes from the Latin word for gold, aurum. Who invented the periodic table? Well, this ingenious method of organizing elements was developed in 1869 by a Russian scientist named Dmitry Mendeleev. Although Mendeleev's method was later revised, it served as a basis for the method that is still being used today. In 1869, Mendeleev was writing a chemistry textbook and wanted to find a way to organize the 63 known elements so it would be easier for students to learn about them. That's right. In Mendeleev's time, scientists only knew of 63 elements and that's it. He made a set of cards of the elements similar to a deck of playing cards. On each card, he wrote the name of a different element, its atomic mass, and other known properties. Mendeleev arranged and rearranged the cards in many different ways, looking for a pattern. He finally found that if he placed eight elements in order by increasing atomic mass in each row, and then continued on to the next row, the columns of the table would contain elements with similar properties. These columns are sometimes called families, because elements within a column are similar but not identical to one another, just like people in a family. Did you notice the blank spaces in Mendeleev's table? They are empty spaces that Mendeleev left for elements that had not yet been discovered. Mendeleev predicted that these missing elements would eventually be discovered, and he was right. Today, the periodic table has 118 elements. Based on their position in the table, he even predicted their properties. For example, he predicted an element in row 5 of group 3, in which he named Eka Aluminium. Eka means undiscovered element. Mendeleev had given this name because it lies below aluminium in the periodic table. He predicted that this missing element would have an atomic mass of 68 and be a relatively soft metal like other elements in this group. Scientists searched for this missing element and they found it just a few years later. French chemist Paul Emile Lecoq de Bois-Baudran discovered it and named the new element gallium. Where is gallium in the periodic table? That's right, one step away from aluminium. It turned out that Mendeleev's predictions about the properties of this element were also spot on. He also predicted the existence of at least five other elements, including a very rare element called technetium. Scientists searched for all the missing elements in the Mendeleev's table and eventually found all of them. It took time for the periodic table to develop into its current form. Now in the 20th century, there were curved forms of periodic table, such as spirals and helices. Now these were generally deemed to be easier for students to use to learn about the elements compared to a flat two-dimensional table. Eventually, a flat two-dimensional table has been adapted because it fits easily onto one page or as a poster hanging on the wall. Mandeleev's flower would be unrecognizable today. What element was named after Mendeleev? Well, the answer is Mendelevium. Mendelevium is a synthetic element with the symbol MD and atomic number 101. This metallic, radioactive, transuranic element is in the actinide series. During the Cold War, however, honoring a Russian scientist in this manner was 
very controversial. The name Mandalivium was carefully considered and ran past the US government before being proposed to and ratified by IUPAC in 1955 with the symbol MV changed to MD two years later. Well, that's it for today. Thank you for watching.